Hey guys, it's Shayna and today I'm going to show you how to get my Golden Sunset makeup look. So we're going to start with our face. I am going to show you how to make a DIY BB cream using a daily moisturizer, your favorite foundation. You'll need a foundation that's a little bit darker or lighter depending on what season it is. Since it's summer, I need mine to be a little bit darker or you can use a liquid bronzer. And I'm gonna mix all of that together so that I can make my own custom shade because in the summertime, I tend to be a little like a chameleon where I do change colors on a weekly basis. So I'm going to take the brush and pat the BB cream all over until it is distributed evenly. Next I'm going to use this Stowaway Cosmetics Concealer right under my eyes just to kind of give my face that boost and that lift and conceal my dark circles. Now we're going to move to our brows and our eyes. I'm going to be using the Chella Dazzling Dark Brown Eyebrow Color. And this is one of my absolute favorites. I try to keep my brows as natural as possible. Um, I don't really do a whole lot of like sculpting and contouring. I like to set it in place with my Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. I do use a little bit of concealer right under my arch just so that it can hide those little hairs that are deciding to make a comeback. Next, I'm going to put the NYX eyeshadow base in white all over my lid. And then I'm going to take this gold pigment from TKB Trading and apply that all over my lid. This is one of my absolute favorite pigments ever. Um, I've been using this company for the past like five or six years and I usually get the sample sizes because they're like two bucks and you can get the little jars off of eBay. The color that I'm putting all over my lid is Gold Lame. Then I'm gonna use Antique Copper in my crease and I'm gonna blend that out. Now I'm going to use a flesh tone color right under my brow so that I can neutralize it. Now I'm going to use this dark brown pigment called Antique Bronze from TKB Trading and use that in my outer V. And then I'll go ahead and blend that so that it makes the sunset. Next, I'm going to tight line with my Star Looks pencil in Obsidian. I absolutely love Star Looks products. I've been using Star Looks for years and they have really good quality stuff and it lasts a really long time. Now I'm going to apply my eyeliner. I like to use the e.l.f. eyeliner. It's like the one that's a dollar that you get out of like Walmart or Target. Then 
Then I'm gonna do my mascara. I have consistently and faithfully been using Maybelline Colossal Volume Express as well as the Falsies Volume Express. I use both of them to maximize my lashes since I don't wear false lashes. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of that concealer and just kind of clean up where I messed up. So now it's time to contour and highlight. And I'm gonna be using the Starlux Cream Blush in Fallen Angel. And I love this blush because it works like a highlighter. This is one of my favorite things to use during the summer because it gives a nice, even glow and you don't have to worry about wearing blush. Put it on my cheekbones, down the bridge of my nose, in between my eyebrows, my cupid's bow, and my chin. And then I just blend it out with my finger. Next, I'm gonna contour with my NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Powder Foundation. This is one of my favorites because I have really oily skin and it definitely keeps my face matte, but it still kind of gives me that little dewy look. And finally, I'm going to do my lips. So I'm going to use this pencil by Starlux. Again, Starlux is one of my favorite brands. The pencil is in Rosate, and I'm going to use this clear gloss by Smashbox. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.